Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm coming to you with my October Owl Crate unboxing. Owl Crate is one of the only non-Disney subscription boxes that I get, and I absolutely love it. This is a monthly book subscription. They feature young adult literature, and every single month they pick out a special book that goes with the theme of that box, as well as a whole bunch of book-related or bookish goodies um, that kind of accompany the box and that month's theme. I really love this subscription. I think this is the fourth or fifth box that I've gotten from Owl Crate, and so far I have yet to be disappointed. So I'm going to jump right into this and see what is inside the October box. And October is my favorite month of the entire year, so I'm extra excited for this one. So here's my first peek at this month's Owl Crate. I'm trying to let anything fall out here. Right on the top, you have the sort of theme card of the box. This month's theme is Find Me in the Forest, and Owl Crate always does like a cool um, exclusive artwork that goes on the card and um, kind of goes with the theme of their box, so I really like this one. It's like a tree house, and then there's kind of like a spooky vibe to it as well. Perfect for October. And on the back of the card, there is a list of everything that's included. So these are the spoilers and kind of the information about the different um, sellers and vendors that have uh, worked together to put this box um, into place. So I'm going to not read this to you right now, but I'm going to keep it by me for reference. So I'm already super excited about the first thing that I'm pulling out of this box. It is a another box, it's a square shaped box, and it looks like it's about the size of a mug. And sure enough, on the front it says Owl Crate Exclusive Mug October 2017. Even the artwork on this box is pretty, and there's the owl holding the crate. I love it. And I'm even more excited now because on the back of the mug box there is a little clue as to what kind of mug is inside, and it says the Forbidden Forest holds many secrets. The Forbidden Forest. I bet this is something Harry Potter related. I am so excited. Let me open this up. Oh yes, yes, it's in this little bubble wrap. Let's take a look and see. Oh my gosh. This is, um, I, you know I have a whole collection of Disney mugs. I think this is my new favorite non-Disney mug. This mug is absolutely amazing. It is Harry Potter related, and it is a Forbidden Forest exclusive Owl Crate mug. Let me show you this up close. So this is the Forbidden Forest, um, which is part of the Harry Potter world, and it features all kinds of iconic things. So there's um, Hagrid's hut, there's Buckbeak the Hippogriff, um, there's a unicorn, and a centaur, and um, the car that they crash with the big spider. What is his name again? I forget his name, the big scary spider. Tell me his name in the comments down below if you're watching this. Um, so just all kinds of Forbidden Forest kind of iconic things and moments, and it's all in an exclusive artwork on this exclusive Owl Crate mug. So, 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 so cool. Okay, seriously, if this was the only thing in this entire box, I would be thrilled. Um, this kind of made, this made my day. I'm going to put some coffee in this as soon as I finish filming this video, and I'm pretty much going to drink out of this for the rest of the entire holiday season, because in my house, the holiday season is also Harry Potter season. Yay, okay, that was awesome. The next thing I'm pulling out is a small candle, and the candle is from the company In the Wick of Time. I believe it's a company that makes book-related candles, and this candle was actually made exclusively for Owl Crate subscribers and the candle is called Cave's Water, and it says it smells like moss and mint. So there's the top of the little tin, and apparently this is named for the Raven Cycle books, which I have not read, um, but they are high on my list of books to be read. Let me give this a quick sniff. Oh, yep, it smells exactly like moss and mint in the best way possible. It's really kind of it's a little bit like green and also aquatic and also refreshing and like weirdly cozy at the same time. This is a beautiful, beautiful scent. I love candles. I'm a little bit fussy about fragrances, but I absolutely love this smell. Yes, and I'm really excited to burn this, so another awesome item. So far this box is 100% a win for me. Subscription box confetti is kind of the bane of my existence, but I know it's a necessary evil, so let me just put this away. And here is the next item from this box. This is... Riddle's Tea Shop and Curiosity, so it's tea. Um, it's called Sherwood Forest Tea, which of course is a Robin Hood reference. Let me show you a close-up of the really cute label art. So it says, Riddle's Tea Shop and Curiosities, 
Sherwood Forest, Earl Grey and Sweet Blueberry, an Owl Crate exclusive. Cool, so this tea was blended exclusively for Owl Crate subscribers. It sounds really good. I do enjoy a nice cup of tea. I'm gonna drink this out of my new Harry Potter mug that I just showed you. And this is another awesome item from this month's Owl Crate box. The next thing I'm pulling out is super cute. I believe this is a coaster to put your drink on. And uh, let me show you a close-up of this. It says, all good things are wild and free. And it's got some mushrooms and some foliage. And then it's got a fox at the bottom. And I love, love, love foxes. Um, so this is another win for me for sure. I think this coaster goes along perfectly with the forest theme of the box and you can put your mug on your coaster and then put the Sherwood Forest tea in it. So it kind of all goes together and you could light that little candle at the same time. I'm gonna have a whole like evening over this box. The next thing I'm pulling out is this month's button. Every single month they include an Owl Crate button for subscribers that features the, the art of the monthly theme. So here you can see it's that tree house from the Find Me in the Forest art card that I showed you earlier. Very cool. And before we get to the book of the month, I see one more little bookish fun thing in here, and it is actually a bookmark. And it is from Where the Wild Things Are, which I love that book. Who doesn't love that book? Um, and I actually think it's two bookmarks. So there's one here and one here. And um, the maker is called Crafted Van. And I have actually ordered from this seller, I think on Etsy before. So um, kind of a well-known uh, maker of these types of things. And you can see what the back looks like. Awesome, so two little bookmarks and they just kind of loop over the page of the book that you're on and then there's a magnet and it kind of holds the page in place so you don't lose your spot. Oh, just kidding, there's one more thing. There's actually an art print, um, but it was face down, so I didn't realize what it was. So here is, wow, here is a beautiful art print. And here's a close-up of this. I believe this is Princess Mononoke-inspired fan art. It's beautiful, and it kind of goes along with the forest theme, and it kind of, that movie also kind of has a conservation theme, and I'm all about that. So this is really actually a stunning print. I love the goodies that they put into this box. Like everything is artful and thoughtful, and it's just, it's such a well-curated subscription that I just, I nerd out over this so hard. Okay, and now we are moving on to the book of the month, and I'm looking down and I can see the cover art, and I'm, I'm a sucker for beautiful cover art, and this is a gorgeous, gorgeous book. And this month's book is Wild Beauty by Anna Marie McLemore. Let me get it out of the plastic so you can see it with less glare. So here's a close up. What a gorgeous, gorgeous cover. And I do believe that this cover is exclusive to Owl Crate subscribers. That's usually an Owl Crate um, feature that they do. They have like a slightly special or different cover um, that you get when you subscribe to this box. I have no idea what this book is about, but I'm going to get on Goodreads and look it up shortly after I finish filming this video. And I know you're not supposed to judge a book by its cover, but I can tell you right now by looking at this cover, I will be picking this up and diving in very soon. Very, very gorgeous, gorgeous book. Here are the goodies that were included with the book itself. These were kind of tucked into the cellophane wrapping. So there is a note from the author. Um, so I'll be reading this. Usually there's some insight about the book or the characters or the writing process, and I, I love learning stuff like that. There is also a signed book plate, so between having the author's signature as well as um, the exclusive cover, you really get like an awesome, unique, and special edition of the book in, in this box. And then this is really unique. There's actually a packet of seeds in here. I think they are wildflower seeds. So I don't really know what the book's about, but I'm sure there's something to do with flowers. Um, and I love that they included a packet of seeds. I've never gotten something like this in a box before. So awesome job finding a really unique um, little add-on, little perk. This is super, super cool. And finally, there's just two more little pieces that are kind of tucked into the bottom of the box. These are staples in every Owl Crate box. So first there is a magazine that goes with um, this month's theme. I think there's probably an interview with the author. Um, there's a word search. It's just kind of like a fun little um, book to accompany all the items in this in this month's box. And again, it's got that beautiful artwork that they feature. And this is the spoiler card for next month's box. And next month's box, the November box, the theme is Castles, Courts, and Kingdoms. Castles, Courts, and Kingdoms. That looks awesome. 
I'm so excited for the November box. And honestly, this box that I just opened for you was probably my favorite Elle Crate subscription box that I have ever received. I loved every single item in there, especially this amazing Harry Potter mug. Like, oh, this was, I think this is the best item I've ever gotten in Elle Crate box, pretty much period. And I cannot wait to drink something warm out of it. And yes, I just love the subscription. So if you are into reading um, and if you like fantasy stories like Robin Hood and Harry Potter and Game of Thrones and Lord of the Rings, they always put like such a nice little selection of nerdy bookish things into these boxes and I cannot recommend this subscription enough if that appeals to your personality at all. I'm going to leave a link down below if you want more information on subscribing to Owl Crate. I don't get anything in return if you use my link, I just want you to have that information so um, I've got nothing to gain other than just spreading the Owl Crate love and I believe their November box is currently for sale. So if you want to check out the castles, courts, and kingdoms themed box, you should click the link below. Um, that's all I've got for you guys today. I know this wasn't a Disney related video, but most of my videos are Disney related. So if you're a Disney fan and you're not yet subscribed, you might want to hit subscribe down below. And I will be back probably tomorrow um, with another video. I've got a ton of content coming up in the next couple of weeks. Enjoy October, you guys. It's the best month. And I will see you all real soon. Have a magical day.